Happy Friday, Buck Nation. I'm Grayson Maness. Today is Friday, October 21st. Today we have Josh with the weather, Quinn with sports, and Nyla with some important announcements. Good morning, Buckhorn. I'm Joshua Reynolds here with this upcoming week's weather. And as you can see throughout the week, we're going to have highs between the mid 60s and uh, high 80s at one point, with an 88 is our high, but it does look like it's going to be 60% chance of rain. And uh, also, I'd like to mention that the drought is over. We did receive rain a couple days ago. Rain, not rain, my bad. Anyway, so as you can see throughout the week, there is very low percentage chance of rain, 0, 0, 20, 10, you know. And now we're going to go over to Quinn with some important sports announcements. Um, good morning, Buckhorn. This is Quinn heading with the sports. First off, I would like to thank everybody who came out to support Buckhorn Athletics this past week and weekend. On Saturday in cross country, Kira got ninth overall and Amelia got fourth overall. And the varsity girls as a team got second overall. On Tuesday, Amelia won again and the girls got another third place. Good job to all our cross country girls. And please come out to support all our cross country teams this Saturday at the Last Chance Invitational at Palmer Park. In other sports news, the ninth grade football team won their last game against Lincoln County, leaving the team with an overall 4-4 record. I hope to see all y'all come out next year and play for JV and Varsity. The volleyball girls played in a big tournament on Monday, and unfortunately they took the L against Sparkman. Better luck next time. The next, next week we'll have two swim team meets. The, one will be on Tuesday and one will be on Thursday. Please come out and support our swim team. Finally, we have, finally we come to varsity football. Everybody, please come out and support our Buckhorn Bucks as they go against some stiff competition at Bob Jones today as they face the Bob Jones Patriots. Now over to Natalie with some important announcements. Good morning, everyone. I hope everyone's had a great week. I have a few congratulations and announcements before we leave for the weekend. Congrats to Ms. Tran for winning Valley's Top Teacher this week. We're really blessed to have someone like her teaching at Buckhorn. Congrats to the band for earning all superior ratings, best in class, percussion, and drum major, and overall bronze this past weekend. It's always great to see our band and receive awards for all their hard work. Finally, congrats to the BHS debate team for their tournament this past weekend. Tara Hawkins and Luke McCombs won first in their duo, and Greg Petit won third in HI and DI. So congrats to all of those people I just mentioned. Next to the announcements, Rib Ribbon Week is upon us. So here's the days if you haven't heard. Monday, my personal favorite, Pajama Day. Uh, Tuesday is Hawaiian Day. Wednesday is Red Day, so just wear a red shirt or whatever. Thursday is BHS theme, and Friday is Halloween. So just stay in dress code, and we can all have fun. Seniors, the senior slideshow preparation is upon us already, even though it's only late October. So start emailing your baby pictures, elementary and middle school pictures to bhsseniors at gmail.com. The deadline for those is December 9th, and you can send up to five pictures per person. Please include names. That will be a great help to us all. If you ordered a Buckhorn Belief shirt, make sure to pick it up during lunch, either Thursday the 27th or Friday the 28th and wear it on Monday the 31st to be in a picture during second block. Finally, don't forget that the Drama Club is presenting Mama Won't Fly tonight and tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the Blue Gym. Admission is $5. It'd be great to see a bunch of you out there supporting the theater club. That's all we have for today. Thanks for watching, and make sure to tune in next week.